Hey everybody, Kelvin, aka Mr. Kelvo here. Wanted to give you a better look at my custom 12 inch Mezco Charred Chucky. I did this uh, using uh, a stitched Mezco Chucky. And what I did was I uh, added a lot of liquid latex, um, cotton. I used that to kind of build up his face here. Kind of fill in the gaps of his uh, stitches. Real charring and burning of his hair. Lots of melted flesh. Check out this side. I tried to do as good a job of building up that eye. It actually kind of pops out quite a bit and covers up the side there. Did all the clothes by burning them myself. Lots of... Uh, fire and ash and soot. Um, I wanted to use as little paint on his clothing as I could. I think it came out pretty good. Some nice melted details on the hand there. But this was a super fun project to do. Um, the ending of Child's Play 1 is what inspired this look. I mean, it's just pretty badass. All the way down to his good guy shoes. If you look inside, uh, kind of check out, there's a lot more damage and melted flesh on his legs. Um, I did some on his sleeve up here. But uh, it took me a long time, a very long project to do. Lots of waiting for things to dry and re-sculpting. Um, the actual melted parts are actually liquid latex that I just put on over everything and let it kind of just drip down Has a nice translucent look to it at some parts um, I did try painting it a little bit more fleshy toned, but when I did that It lost the, the look of the melted plastic. It just looked like I painted drippy marks on them So I kind of scratched that and tried to reapply um, on this section here so you can see that drips uh, that goops a bit more prominent than the rest you can see his nose is kind of almost translucent lots of flesh around his mouth there but uh, yeah I tried to get some grays in there as well as just the blacks it's kind of hard to see but it's definitely in there and even washed out that eye a little bit um, he's got kind of smoky eyes in the movie so Try to get that effect as good as possible. Swim them around so you can see the back here. Lots of melted plastic up there. Good weathering all around. Took a long time cutting and scratching and pulling threads and getting this guy up to where I wanted him. But it all came from this guy. You approve, Chucky? Chucky approves. But anyways, that is my custom Mezco Charred Chucky. Uh, I spent a lot of time on him. I might do a small run of these in the future. I'm not sure. It kind of depends on how easy it is to get a hold of the Mezco stitched guys for a reasonable price. But anyways, there he is. Charred Chucky. Your friend till the end. <laughs> See you, Chuck. <laughs>